On March 30th, Palestinians in Gaza began six weeks of peaceful, nonviolent protest to demand an end to the crippling, death-like siege that they live under and call for their rights under international law to return to their lands and homes displaced from in 1948. Israel, Israel responded to these peaceful protests with live ammunition. Already 31 peaceful protesters, including journalists and children, have been killed by Israel and over 2,000 wounded. Israelis killing the peaceful protesters in Gaza. Uh, I, I, I am not thinking in from our office on that. Have you been following what's going on in Gaza? Um, I, I'm, I really don't have time to talk about it. You don't have time to talk about it? Peaceful protesters being killed by the Israeli government as we're giving them over $3 billion a year. I wonder why you're blocking an investigation into the Israeli use of excessive yeah. force in Gaza? Yeah. The international community would like that investigation to go forward. You know, Israel deserves to be held accountable just like any other country. The killing of peaceful protesters, including a journalist wearing a press vest in Gaza, and the UN is being blocked from investigating. And she's attending as a guest right now? Well, we're all here as guests. Hi, hi, hi. 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 We're trying to get Congress people to come out in favor of the peaceful protesters in Gaza and against the shooting of the peaceful protesters. Is that something you'd be willing to publicly state? <laughs> peaceful protesters deserve the right to protest? Absolutely, they do. Yeah. Would you maybe put out a statement? Bernie Sanders put out one. We just need to, you know, be behind the idea that Israel can't shoot people when they're peacefully protesting. Definitely, definitely can. We'd appreciate if you put out something publicly. Thank you, Congresswoman. <laughs> U.S. Congress is remaining silent, and this is unacceptable. The longer Congress remains silent, the more Palestinians will die during these protests. We demand that Congress speak up and condemn these attacks by Israel, these massacres of peaceful protesters. Call on your members of Congress and tell them to speak up for Gaza. Dial 202-224-3121, the Capitol switchboard, and speak to your representatives in Congress. Tell them to demand that Israel stop massacring peaceful protesters in Gaza.